and uh, there's never a dull moment on a shuttle flight. And so uh, Jim and I are wearing our T-shirts this morning because we uh, basically got up and uh, had this uh, procedure to fly, and then we were going to exercise afterwards. Uh, but you can see this procedure um, it had some uh, fairly close clearances with the GEM module, but all of it could be viewed basically out of the commander's window. It was awesome. And this is Clay and me transferring another rack today. And today we transferred two racks into the space station. This is Wolf, uh, the Earth Observatory rack, which goes into the U.S. laboratory. It enhances uh, the Earth observation capability a lot with uh, uh, remote uh, sensing capability and a remote control of the Wolf. Uh, the window and the camera and video cameras. If you see the rack, it's so big, it just fits the hut. So we have to very we have to be very careful. We didn't hit any uh, hot shield or structures. So we move very slow and steady. And this is another teamwork. Uh, two or three crew members uh, work together to transfer uh, the wolf rock and another express rock seven today. I was actually uh, behind Elka waiting to get through the lab um, when this was going on, watching her do it. Now, several of us have commented that uh, Naoko and Soichi are doing these transfer ops, that they're uh, like fish in water. They uh, they move so gracefully with these these so huge racks that uh, weigh, camp. you know, hundreds of pounds. So um, it's Good one of those things where if you get it, Get it moving in the wrong direction. It's really oh, hard to sorry, stop no. it, and uh, they've just done a great job. Uh, serial number uh, 1041 CSAO2. Looks like it's got a low battery. It, we don't have a low battery message, but uh, all the wagon wheels are gone, so it's just the center pivot. And then the other one's got uh, one, two, three, four, five bars left. Looking forward to having that to uh, back installed. It's been a long time waiting to fly on orbit, so we were great. We were very uh, Clay, happy to be able a, to install uh, go it. To change out the low and a lot of great work was done today by Noko and Suichi and Jax. And the entire crew actually getting the racks in and installed, so our chance for us were going very well. Checking. Again, this video may look sideways Thank to some, you. but uh, again, uh, like, like we said yesterday, there really is no up and down in space. So uh, I was uh, turned one direction at orientation in the lab, and Suichi and Elko were turned in, in another direction. And they were maneuvering this very large object into place. Uh, and uh, several uh, other ISS crew members have obviously been here on station, and the lab window has been a very useful tool for doing Earth observation. And uh, this rack will make it even more so. And it is going into place. And uh, most of our day, all of us were uh, at some point doing transfer, um, which uh, is a lot like moving. And we talked a little bit about yesterday how it's um, kind of like a game where you have to move some things out of the station to, to make room for things coming out of the multipurpose logistics module. And uh, today we were really putting that dance into play. And when you go into the multipurpose logistics module, it is very empty. And now we have the hard task of filling it back up. So uh, now we're going and finding a whole bunch of bags and trying to figure out where they go. And as you can see, that's a lot of teamwork, and uh, what a great team. And here's a zoom in on the uh, wharf emblem in place. A little after uh, Dottie and I did the uh, PDRS work, got a chance to go over and work on the A-RED, the Advanced uh, Resistive Exercise Device. You can see here, I've been squats. It's really effective, and it uh, feels good to put some weight on the legs. A-RED's a great machine, and uh, here's Jim racking the, uh, the, the bar in the upper position, and yeah, you can see where it just floats. This is Rick in the airlock uh, preparing for our EVA-2 tomorrow. 
Uh, he and Clay uh, spent a lot of time today preparing tools and getting the suits ready to go and checking out all the systems and, and uh, making sure that uh, all, everything's ready to go for tomorrow's, uh, tomorrow's long EVA. Airlock, Houston, Space Ground One, the Big Loop. This is a uh, picture of the uh, tool setup in the crew lock. Go ahead, Hal, would you? Of the, uh, the International okay, Space Station airlock. Uh, batteries this is some are more located exercise, in lab uh, one, on the overhead five, alpha two, in and CSA is, uh, CP. Actually, uh, in front of uh, X to the cupola uh, module. So while exercising, uh, we can enjoy the view of the Earth through the cupola window, and it is fantastic. Working out in space is actually a lot of fun. Um, we, on the shuttle, we have a cycle ergometer, and uh, we've been using that. I guess I should probably talk about this. I'm checking all the tools that are going to go outside tomorrow for the EVA, uh, making sure that the guys have... Thank you. Discovery Houston on the big loop for your, uh, for Dottie, for your question. And, uh, go ahead, thank you. Daddy, regarding your question about uh, EVA, we are good with uh, uh, BRTing to the circular handrail at the airlock. Thanks, Augie, for such a quick response. I really appreciate those guys checking it down, and uh, I'll let Rick know. That'll be a, a really tremendous help. All right, I think we're ready for EVA, too, tomorrow. Absolutely. We're looking forward to it, too. Sensation on the big loop for PMC, PHC, PFC. We're with you, Tracy. Go ahead. No matter how much I screwed up, um, is uh, has the call connected? We think it has. Can you uh, give a call and try, and uh, we'll uh, talk to the back room here. On uh, public call four, right? That's correct. Am I?
Now it seems to be quiet. We're checking. He will be ready for the fire pass here in a moment. We're ready to privatize. Who's this? Is this Steve Hart? Station Houston, Space Ground 1 for Tracy. We're still trying to troubleshoot your connection. Uh, we're going to reconnect the, uh, the party and try again. Okay, Al. Thanks a lot.
station, Houston, space to ground one for the airlock. Go ahead, Houston. Yeah, Clay, uh, we're showing 43 minutes on our timer. When you hit 45 minutes on your counter, we're ready for hatch closure. Coffee house, thanks.